at least one person had died and two students have been injured in clashes between South African University students and police at the University of Witwatersrand in Johannesburg. Without warning, they launched a stunt grenade. After launching the stunt grenade, they would then fire rubber bullets. Uh, in the midst of firing rubber bullets, one of our colleagues was shot dead. And we are here at this point to honor and mourn the passing of that colleague. The sporadic protest began in early January over the alleged exclusion of some students by a government-sponsored tuition aid scheme. Students are demanding that the university allow all students with outstanding debt to register for the 2021 academic year. Students vowed to continue protesting against the financial exclusion. The school authorities, however, said that if it continues to accept students who have historical debt, the institution will become financially unstable. The university says it owed 1 billion South African rand in outstanding fees accumulated over the past seven years. While the debt of the university is rising, students are demanding that those who owe the university up to 150,000 rand in fees should be allowed to register for the new academic year. On Monday, the Minister for Higher Education announced that the government-funded National Student Financial Aid Scheme, which provides study loans to poor students, is facing a financial funding shortfall. He cited the country's economic downturn amid the COVID-19 pandemic among the reasons for the shortage of funds. Kamel Sadiq, CBA TV.